Welcome to the Mind Spark, your source for breaking news and trending stories from around the world. The world of global trade is buzzing with electrifying news. Headlines are lighting up financial centers and shipping hubs across the globe as industry leaders and governments alike scramble to understand the implications of a groundbreaking development. A monumental project is taking shape, one that could redraw the maps of international shipping forever. This isn't just another infrastructure upgrade, it's a bold vision that could transform the very arteries of global commerce. Imagine for a moment, a brand new canal slicing through the heart of Mexico, directly linking the Atlantic and Pacific Oceans. This engineering marvel would create a shortcut for ships, bypassing thousands of miles and days of travel. This isn't just local infrastructure, it's a development that could shift the balance of global economic power. By offering an alternative to existing routes, it could alter the flow of goods, energy and resources on a massive scale. Backed by a staggering $50 billion in Chinese investment, this canal aims to rival the legendary Panama Canal. The involvement of China signals not only financial muscle, but also a strategic play in the global logistics game. For centuries, humanity has dreamed of conquering geography, connecting oceans to shorten distances and boost trade. From the Suez to the Panama Canal, these feats have changed the world. And now, history may be repeating itself in a new land. This proposed Mexican canal is the latest chapter in a dramatic story of maritime engineering. Teams of experts are working around the clock, pushing the boundaries of what's possible in construction and design. It's designed to accommodate the world's largest ships, vessels even the expanded Panama Canal can't handle. These megaships carry thousands of containers, and their efficient passage could revolutionize shipping economics. A faster, more efficient route could save billions in shipping costs and lower prices for consumers worldwide. Ports could see a surge in activity, and supply chains might become more resilient and responsive. But with such ambition comes risk, financial, environmental, and geopolitical. The project faces fierce debate over its impact on local communities, ecosystems, and the delicate balance of international relations. The world will be watching. Will this be a modern marvel that propels us into a new era, or a cautionary tale of overreach and unintended consequences? The stakes could not be higher. The outcome of this project could reshape global trade for decades, influencing everything from the price of goods to the balance of power among nations. The future of how we connect, trade, and travel may be about to change forever. As the sun rises on this new chapter, the world waits to see if this bold vision will become reality, ushering in a new era for global commerce. To truly grasp the potential impact of a new canal in today's world, we must first look back at the enduring legacy of the Suez Canal, a waterway that forever changed the course of history. When it opened in 1869, the Suez Canal was nothing short of revolutionary. For the first time, Europe and Asia were directly connected by sea, bypassing the need for the long, treacherous voyage around the southern tip of Africa. Before the canal, ships had to brave the unpredictable and often dangerous waters around the Cape of Good Hope, a journey that could add weeks, even months, to their travels. The Suez Canal slashed travel times dramatically, making global trade faster, safer, and more efficient. The economic impact was immediate and profound, shipping costs plummeted, trade volumes soared, and new global connections flourished. Ports along the route boomed, and entire economies were reshaped by the new flow of goods and ideas. The Suez Canal quickly became a vital artery for empires, a lifeline that fueled industrial growth and colonial ambitions. But it was also a flashpoint, a focal point for international politics, military standoffs, and power struggles that shaped the modern world. Its construction was a monumental feat of human determination and ingenuity. Engineers and laborers overcame immense technical, environmental, and financial challenges carving a passage through desert sands and marshlands to connect two great seas. The Suez Canal set the gold standard for megaprojects inspiring the creation of the Panama Canal decades later and now perhaps Mexico's ambitious canal project which aims to reshape trade routes once again. But the Suez Canal's legacy is a double-edged sword. It stands as both an inspiration and a cautionary tale. While such projects can transform economies and connect continents, they can also ignite fierce geopolitical competition, crises, and even conflict. Control over a canal means control over the flow of global trade, a power that nations have fought over for generations and one that continues to shape international relations today. 
As China invests heavily in Mexico's canal project, it echoes the great power plays that once centered on the sands of Egypt, raising questions about influence, sovereignty, and the future of global commerce. The lessons of Suez are clear. New waterways can change the world, but not without significant risks and costs. Blockages, political unrest, and environmental challenges have all left their mark on the canal's history. As Mexico embarks on its own canal journey, the stakes are just as high, offering the promise of prosperity, but also the potential for new rivalries and unforeseen consequences. The proposed Mexican Canal is a project of breathtaking ambition. Spanning 186 miles across the Isthmus of Tehuantepec, it's more than a waterway, it's a logistics corridor. The plan includes new deep water ports, a parallel freight railway, and industrial parks along the route. At $50 billion, it's one of the most expensive infrastructure projects ever. Designed to handle the world's largest ships, it directly challenges the Panama Canal's dominance. Chinese investment is the driving force, providing capital and expertise. For Mexico, it's a chance to transform its southern region into a global logistics hub. The stakes, a bold gamble that could redefine Mexico's role in world trade. The Mexican Canal is emerging as a crucial piece in China's ambitious Belt and Road Initiative, a project that is reshaping the global landscape. This massive infrastructure undertaking is not just about moving goods, it's about forging new connections and alliances that will define the future of international trade and influence. The BRI or Belt and Road Initiative is a vast and far-reaching global infrastructure strategy. It aims to build an interconnected network of roads, railways, and ports that span continents linking Asia, Africa, Europe, and now, the Americas. By investing in these projects, China is creating new pathways for commerce and cooperation, while also expanding its own reach. This canal fits perfectly into the maritime dimension of the BRI, serving as a vital link that extends China's influence deep into the Western Hemisphere. It's not just about shipping lanes, it's about establishing a presence and building relationships in regions previously dominated by other powers. For China, the canal offers a secure and strategic alternative to the Panama Canal, reducing its vulnerability to geopolitical tensions and potential blockades. This new route could ensure the steady flow of goods, even in times of international uncertainty. Ultimately for China, this project is about more than just economics. It's about gaining strategic leverage, opening up new markets, enabling faster and more efficient shipping, and securing a significant stake in the world's critical infrastructure. It's a move that could reshape global trade patterns for decades to come. The canal project also signals a dramatic shift in Latin America's alliances, challenging the long-standing dominance of the United States in the region. As China deepens its ties, new opportunities and tensions are emerging, reshaping the political landscape. Mexico now finds itself at the crossroads of a new era, balancing global competition with the promise of international cooperation. The choices made today will have lasting impacts on its economy, its politics, and its role on the world stage. In the end, the canal is far more than just a waterway. It stands as a powerful symbol of shifting power, changing alliances, and the dawn of a new chapter in global relations. For Mexico, the canal promises immense economic benefits. Construction could create hundreds of thousands of jobs, boosting local economies in the underdeveloped South. The vision, a thriving economic corridor with new ports, factories, and logistics centers. Southern Mexico could become a major manufacturing and trade hub, attracting global investment. Upgraded infrastructure, ports, railways, highways would benefit the entire region. Improved transport links could spur growth in agriculture, tourism, and other sectors. Globally, a new canal could lower shipping costs and prices for consumers. Competition with the Panama Canal could drive efficiency and innovation. The promise, a more integrated, prosperous economy for Mexico and the world. Hopes are high for a brighter future. Yet the canal faces grave environmental and social concerns. Cutting a 186-mile channel would devastate biodiverse ecosystems. Rainforests, wetlands, mangroves, endangered species and fragile habitats are at risk of irreversible damage. Indigenous communities could be displaced, losing ancestral lands and cultural heritage. Waterways and aquifers may be disrupted, threatening fresh water supplies. The risk of pollution, oil spills and invasive species looms large. Critics demand thorough environmental assessments and real consultation with affected communities. The dilemma, can progress come without sacrificing nature and human rights? 
The engineering challenges are staggering. Billions of cubic meters of Earth must be moved, requiring a massive fleet of machinery. The route crosses the Sierra Madre Mountains, demanding enormous locks to lift ships over the terrain. These locks must be earthquake-resistant as the region is seismically active. Water management is critical. A lock-based canal needs vast amounts of fresh water. Securing a sustainable water supply without harming local communities or ecosystems is a major hurdle. Innovative solutions are needed, but long-term sustainability remains uncertain. The technical risks are as great as the rewards. Success will require unprecedented engineering ingenuity. The Mexican Canal could reshape global trade and geopolitics. It promises economic opportunity, but also intensifies US-China rivalry. The project forces us to confront a crucial question. Can we balance growth with protecting our planet and respecting human rights? True success means integrating environmental and social concerns from the start. Transparent studies, green technologies, and genuine consultation are essential. The canal's legacy should be measured by shared prosperity and environmental stewardship. As the world watches, this project will set a precedent for future mega-projects. The choices made now will shape our world for generations.